As y'all saw, Nick is sleeping. He is not the only one. My dog Chevy was sleeping, but I woke him up. I woke up Chevy to give him a dog bone, but I'm also about to make breakfast. It's almost 4 p.m. I woke up at like 10, but I'm about to make breakfast now because Hot girls eat breakfast in the afternoon. So I'm gonna throw the bacon on this grill skillet thing. I got all the pans warm. Now it's just time to start getting everything pulled out. Yeah. Open up the bacon. I should probably cut that part out, but unnecessary. It's all raw. So I'm gonna throw on four pieces of bacon. My brother just went to work, so no need to hook him up. I was just working on a YouTube video request for Jackie right before I started filming this. And then right before that, I was playing Fortnite. And then before that, I was watching 90 Day Fiance and dealing with Jasmine because Jasmine's been kind of fussy yesterday and today. So Nick and I have been giving her like extra attention. My big bags are not there. They're here. Let's see if it opens. Oh. Okay. I'm just gonna get the rest of this bacon. Put it in here. If I didn't already say, we're doing French toast and bacon. These skillets are mad hot. Ooh. Putting the bacon away. I'm gonna get out my milk and eggs. For the French toast. And then I'm gonna get a mixing bowl. A mixing bowl. A mixing plate. So pickles, if you haven't already watched me make French toast before, you're about to learn. So we got our eggs and our milk. I'm gonna get two eggs, crack the egg, give the eggshell to your dog. Two eggs cracked. And just a splash of milk. I know some of y'all like measurements. There's your measurement. Just a splash of milk. Just zest it up. Now, I'm going to grab me a fork. And just start going and beating them. You want to make sure when you're beating them, the egg doesn't really stick to the fork. So, that's too much. Beat it some more. Okay, so I'm going to add some more milk based off that. Just another splash. Warm up the uh, bacon a little bit more. And mix, 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 mix some more. 
And with that, see that's that's better. That's kind of the consistency you want, kind of falling through the fork. With that being said, you'll go in your spice cabinet. You'll go grab your ground cinnamon and just go ham. Just go ham until the color of the egg changes. And make sure it's dark. Okay? So mixing all that cinnamon. And getting the cinnamon off the walls of the bowl. I'm gonna start changing color here. Just mixing it. With that being said, I'm gonna add some vanilla extract or vanilla flavoring. If I can find it. There it is. With that, I'm going to just throw a splash. Splash in there. For those who like measurements, about two teaspoons. Two teaspoons will work. And you mix that in. And then you can do a little bit of nutmeg and or some sugar. So those two are both optional. I do sugar, not nutmeg. No hate against the nutmeg. I do sugar, but not the nutmeg, just because I usually don't want to take the time looking for the nutmeg in the spice cabinet. So I'm just grabbing a pinch of sugar, throwing it in there, and then a second pinch of sugar, throwing it in there, and mix. And voila, you have your French toast mix. Now you want to pour it on the plate. So you have the mix and you want to pour it on the plate. Pretty much. And then just put your, uh, your bread onto the plate. So let me locate the bread. The bread is probably in the garage fridge. Let me go get it. Oops, someone's awake. It's Jasmine the baby. Okay. I went and secured the bread. Now I'm opening the bread. And I am going to dip it in the bath. The plate. So I'm gonna start off with my, my four pieces. Booty bread goes last, and literally just drop it in the plate. Soak one side, drop it in the plate. Soak another side, and then throw in the skillet. That simple. Now I'm gonna do that two more times. Do what I do, put it all back on the plate. Okay, so I have three pieces cooking at once right now. So I'm about to flip the bacon.
just depends on what pan you use and that's how it's gonna look but um these ones are going on a lower heat than this one anyways y'all get it y'all get it Piece of bread, the dip, the dip, and twist, the dip and twist. Really just make sure you soak up all what's left on that um, plate. And now the plate is empty. Rinse off the plate. Okay, and then I will dry my hands. Oops. Dry my hands. Booty bread. Back in for another day. So I used three eggs. I threw another egg in off camera, and that made six slices. Where did my twisty tie go? Oh, it's under y'all. Thank you. Okay. So. With that being said, breakfast is pretty much ready to go. I just gotta put all this away and by the time I put everything away, it's gonna be ready. I'm gonna cut up this apple as well for delectableness. Okay, I'm gonna turn off this grill, flip these patties. Everything's looking good and juicy over here. Put away the sugar. Put away the seasonings. Rinse out the bowl. supposed to look like nice and nice and pretty okay with that being said I'll grab another plate slice up this apple Try to get in there. Get the last one up. 
This is the last one. Looking good. Just gonna finish slicing the apple. I call these apple chips or apple chips. Get your apple chips. All right. So, grab a new plate. Split the apples. Bacon. French toast. Boom, 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 boom. Alrighty, guys, breakfast is served. I hope you guys are, you know, maybe trying out these recipes. Somebody told me they tried out my um, mini sausages in the biscuit, the pigs in a blanket. I hope you guys enjoy the gig. And these are, again, these are all of our ideas. You know what I'm saying? Like we're just coming together so we don't starve from boredom of eating the same thing every day. So I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Nick is asleep, but I'm about to go wake him up with breakfast. And I think, I think Jazz fell back asleep too. I'm going to check. What a sweetheart. Alrighty guys, well that concludes this vlog. Um, I would, I would say y'all can watch me stir up Nick's, but he, I don't know when he's gonna wake up officially, officially, so I don't wanna force him to eat. But hope y'all enjoyed. Kisses. <laughs> Lastly, Nick and I have been talking about going on another cruise. We haven't been on a we haven't been on a cruise in some time. Nick and I have been on one together, and I think I've been on three in my entire life with my parents. So, or maybe four. I think I have the fourth one was with Nick. I don't know. I can't recall. But regardless, Nick's excited. He was like, I hate cruises when we were there, but now he's wanting to go again. And you have to plan them like a year in advance or even two. So we're starting to search on those. So don't worry. I won't be missing y'all anytime soon. And plus, I'll have stuff pre-recorded for y'all when that time comes. But breakfast looks so good. My mouth is salivating. Um, I added butter onto them in that last clip. If y'all didn't notice, that's just the last thing you need to do. I wanted to note that and you can add cinnamon on top. You can cut your apple slices and put them on top or do strawberries, whatever. Whatever suits y'all's fancy, you know, you know what toppings y'all like. So I'm about to go eat. Cheers. <laughs>